Ooh. Does this look useful? What's this? It's his party hall. Maybe a gem for different statues. That's actually a I'll good point. It. Let's hold on to these gems then. Aha. Hello. Look who it is, everybody. It's Sniper McSheep. <laughs> hey, kids. It's time for Extend TV. This will be the fourth Conquest video, huh? Hopefully we get a good hint sometime soon. If not, we'll need fan service to keep us interested. Like bikinis or a strip tease, you know? He's not wrong. You need to pretend to care even if you lose interest. Be a professional, show. Now, the title for today's episode is... Gluttony Part 3, The Forbidden Fruit. It's solid cheap. Wow, that sounds like an obvious bait. Let's check it out. Oh? You were you? Um. Apologies for waking you. Excuse me? What's it? What's with this situation right here? Oh, Peep sure knows how to raise him. <laughs> you. <laughs> I think you're gonna leave him all alone in his room? Not me too. I can't, in case you're being more really like moi. Look exactly like her from behind. Oh no! I thought we were done! I thought we were done with the incest! What the hell? I'm getting flashbacks of chapter 2 2, Grotto! Oh no! Maybe the nanotechnology research facility that was started several years ago. They primarily focus on nanomachine research for medical use. Indeed, the research has been stuck in a roadblock for quite some time now. But recently, a certain country interested in our research agreed to assist us with the technology. Realizing their technology, we can make several years worth of advancement in nanomachine research. Incest is one incest chapter. How many now? This is the second chapter. That is wonderful news. Well, that's not all. If this goes well, it'll pave the way to break through in another project. It's top secret, but I suppose you should know about it. Regeneration through the use of nanomachines. That's the other project Mani has been researching. In fact, you could say that uh, that is the main objective. All of the research is done to advance this project. In other words, human cloning! There it is! Cloning! <laughs> this research becomes... Realized I could create as many copies of myself as I wished. It's essentially immortality, and it'll be all under the all under our management. The future Mashiro Group will be handling human cloning as a business venture. Are you really conducting such research? I've already succeeded in creating a cloned child with the same genetic code as the original. <laughs> Though I can't introduce you two for obvious reasons. The biggest hurdle is the transference of their memories, but now what's that look for? You seem like you have no objections. Do you realize Mashiro Group is about to become the pioneer of human cloning? His decisions are absolute. The Mashiro family must obey him. That is what Mother taught me, but... I am opposed to this business of human cloning. Explain yourself. Thankfully, Chapter 2 was not incest, but only NTR. Well, kind of, yeah. I mean, if you really want to get technical with it, I... None of that was really incest, what Zen went through, because... His grandfather didn't sleep with anybody he was actually blood-related to. He just slept with his son's wife. And then, um... Among other things. So, I mean, it's it's like incest by proximity. This is real incest right now. <laughs> we gotta get technical. Can't believe I gotta get technical about incest on my goddamn videos. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Uh, by the way, I thought this thing was the about the sin of gluttony. Exactly what is he being eaten here? Well, gluttony could be more than more than just about food. But I, here's the thing about gluttony. It, it's it's very closely related to greed. They're both not exactly the same thing, but they're very similar. There's a clone of me, which you no longer need me. 
I'm surprised you talk back to me about this. This stems from jealousy for your own clone. Yeah, gluttony isn't limited to food. That's why greed and gluttony are kind of pretty closely entwined. Gluttony could be considered consumption of something, I suppose. Where greed is sort of like this desire for material possessions, whether it be money, fame, uh, status, yeah, objects, these sweet dope ass figures I got on myself. That, that could be greed. Gluttony could be consuming of some form of substance. The easiest thing is food, right? But you can also be glutton for <laughs> glutton for punishment. Uh, no, but it, it's mm. gluttony of knowledge. Yeah, yeah. Look at these seven deadly sins. Merlin is a sin of gluttony because she hunger for knowledge. Merlin. Uh, oh, from Seven Deadly Sins, the anime? I actually haven't watched that. I haven't seen it. Yeah, overindulge. Right, exactly. Don't you worry. You're my lovely little doll, my precious daughter. The other thing is we don't have all the information about this quite yet either. So, we may not have seen the gluttony portion. You, my beloved daughter, cannot convince me to change my plans for the cloning business. The president's will is the will of Mashiro. Mashiro Group will endeavor to make it a reality. Famous status fallen or lust? Eh. Potentially, potentially. I am a doll, that is what my father needs me. I'm a doll shaped like my mother. Yes, father. Obey and support the president as the daughter. Oh god, here we go. This was anime about reviewing prostitute monster girls. Today it's incest. Last night was saying Ellen Jack Garner drawing dicks because <laughs> streams are going downhill these days. Oh no! Chugga why? <laughs> Chuggin was saying no. Uh, yeah, I know. I feel bad for Yuma too. Heard this backstory is kind of, kind of, kind of fucked up a little bit. The gluttony might actually be more about her family than her specifically, but she's a part of it. As my mother's wish. Yikes! Are we gonna have words? We still I feel like sleep together, even though she's all grown up. She's so close with her father. Oh boy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm be right right now. Maybe a little too close. What's wrong with family being intimate? It sounds wrong when you say it. Seriously. Anyway, I'm surprised Yuma's dad was involved in clone research. Wait. <laughs> Could it be that the person who invented the Extend Machine is? <laughs> told you in the beginning, didn't I? The Extend Machine is a gift from God. Really? We're going with that angle again? Come on now. Maybe it was a present from Santa? My dad was the kind of jerk that would fill my stockings with puke on Christmas Eve. Whoa, that's awful. We can't all stay starry-eyed children forever. Oh, sorry for making you share another episode with your scumbag dad. I didn't want to ruin the fantasy for them. But they must have figured it out by now. The Extend Machine was built by scientists in a laboratory known as Mani. What? Really? Yeah. Who did you think made it? I totally thought it was made by that rich and fashionable model. You're still yeah. a starry-eyed boy if you think it could be made DIY. Maybe it was made by Beyonce. Who knows? Well then, it's time to introduce our sponsors and say goodbye. Okay, show. Ready? This program is brought to you by the following sponsors. Ah, uh, Kono Bangumi wa. I'll take your tea, Okurishimas. Mashiro Nanotechnology Institute, Mashiro City. God damn it. The Mani Mani statue. Hey! Wait, Yuma, where are you going? We need an explanation. Ryo stands in front of me as I try to quickly walk in front of the group. Then Haruto and the others catch up to us. Don't tell me. Yuma, what was that? Have you known the truth about Mani and what happened to our bodies from the start? You know. Please, Yuma, talk to us. Will we really turn into human clones by your Mashiro group? We fall silent. Seven sets of eyes pierce through me. I knew this would come to light eventually, but this makes my mission much harder to execute. Damn you for stepping in my way, Extend TV. I mentally tuck my tongue. 
Yes, and then he answered with a reply I'd thought of along the way. Yes. Mani is the company Mashiro Group built up for medical nanotechnology research. The name comes from the initials of Mashiro Nanotechnology Institute. Ah! Mani! Alright, fair enough. I am sure some of you have heard of it, even if you do not recognize the logo or abbreviation. It was in the news several years ago when Mashiro Group built an underwater research facility. An underwater research facility? Now that you mention it, I may have heard about that. True. Me too. It was all over the TV and newspapers at the time. But they refused any interviews on the matter, so people eventually stopped talking about it. Besides. Just as you heard on Extend TV, Mani was secretly conducting clone research. The Extend machine must have been made by Mani as well. Hmm? Must have. You say that like you didn't know about the existence of the Extend machine. Yes. Even I was not told everything about it. I do not know what happened to the research or how far it went. Well, I mean... I mean, we know how far it went now. Since I do not know what will be shown in the next Extend TV episode, it is pointless to lie. My mission is the one thing that must be kept from them. If they are unaware, I still have a chance. Huh? So do those Mani people bring us to Garage Island and turn us into clones then? I don't know. As I said, I do not know. I only know Mashiro Group is involved in clone research as one of its business ventures. Wait. Wait a minute. We can't just accept it. I don't know as an answer for everything. Right. I cannot help what I do not know. I woke up and found myself on the island, like the rest of you. It was when Haruto Higurashi was cloned for the first time that I put the pieces together. No. How do we know that you're telling the truth? Hey. Well, we got our side of the story, so why don't we move on? Hmm? Sin? What are you doing? No, no, no. I could ask you the same. I thought you didn't want us to needlessly suspect each other. No. We're not talking about baseless suspicions here. You might turn out to be the liar among us, just like you said. <laughs> Maybe. It doesn't necessarily mean she's our enemy. However. Either way. Seems clear that Mashiro Group is involved somehow. I'm telling you. Then why is she getting exposed with these harassment videos like the rest of us? Even if she freely did it to avoid suspicion, she didn't have to reveal Mashiro Group's involvement. It's true. I agree. And the content of the video was basically child abuse from her parents. It must have hurt her to relive their past like that. Uh -huh. You're right. Sorry, Yuma. We shouldn't have been so harsh on you after you had to watch that. I trust you, Yuma. You're our friend. I get the feeling she doesn't care. Thank you. I'm sorry. I don't question was lacking in love. Let's give her 200 squads worth of apologies, Haruto. Huh? Yeah. Oh, wait, what? Are you actually... Are we actually gonna do that? Zen coming in clutch. Seems I made it out somehow. Perhaps I have Zen Kubota to thank, though I do not understand what it is he's thinking. I still have a chance, but I do not have much time. Must think of a way, a way to exterminate all of us at once. Let's go. We should go. The ship could sink any minute due to my massive weight. Yuba, that's so mean to yourself. <laughs> Your jokes aren't funny at all, Yuma. Come on now. And why are you laughing? Riko Susukino's words echo in my head. Abuse. What abuse? It was exactly what my father and I both wanted. I'd wish to become a substitute for my mother and support Renji Mashiro. That's why I gained weight, changed my clothes, and tried being my mother. Oh, okay. Yikes. Yuma has that big booty. That was what made father smile and made me happy. Riko Susukino's words are nothing more than those of a commoner who cannot comprehend Mashiro's pride. So why? Hmm. Why do they irritate me so? Oh boy, that's uh, that's 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 some that's some tough shit to swallow right there. Hold on one second. I just realized the chat bot actually hasn't been on this whole time, so I'm I'm loading it up. Whoopsie. Uh, we need to we need to have that uh that bot running. Come on, load yourself, my son. While it's loading, actually, I'm gonna go get myself some water. So I'll be right back in a quick second. We are back in DDD. 
There we go. Not really break time, Rogue. Just a quick second while we wait for something to load. All right. Ah. Tasty, tasty agua. The agua of life. Aquavita? Aquavite? All right. Let us keep going. Hmm. Oh, hello. Ready? Eat this. Yeah. Ha <laughs> What? Do we kill it? Stop. Did it just like die? Whoop. That could have been bad. Ah! Stop it. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Ooh. I will take it. Oh, we found a partition. Now that's good to see. Hey. Concentrate. Ready? You're mine. Eat this. Yeah. They won't get away. I think we missed it. Good job, yeah, right. we did. Does this look useful? Take ourselves a fang and an egg. Well, it just, it's okay, I guess. I'm gonna try using it. What the hell did that just do? Oh. Let's mark it on the map. Okay, that's interesting. Who's the one with the Fuck, who's the one with the with the with the Cleone? Where the hell do I see that? Oh, there we go. Who's the one with the Cleone? Pierce type, decay type, heat type. Isn't it is it still Minamo? Yeah, it's still Minamo. I don't think she can use it. Found it! You may break from impact. This is it, right? See, here's the problem. Where did you come from? Ready? They won't get away. Wow! Power. Concentrate. Ow! This. What the hell, you son of a bitch? Jesus Christ! We should mark it. It seems I can't just force it open. Oh, interesting. This is where you ran off to. Dick move. That's a dick move. That it's hurts. Closed. Gonna try using it. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh. Weep. Uh, hey, Zen. Take a breather. Ready? Ready? Full pop. Oh. This. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Huh. Ha. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Rio just took a smack to the face. Playing sad music. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Is that the key? Careful. I'm pretty positive that's a key. What do we have here? We found it. Oh. 
Oh man, this is my first luxury cruise, but there's no good food or expensive liquor on board. There are creatures all over the place too. This is more like a horror movie than a cruise. Oh yeah. Speaking of creatures, clearly are what turn people into creatures, right? What exactly are they? Must be related to Mani somehow since they can be transplanted using the extend machine. Haruto Higarashi glances at me. Fortunately for him, I do not have the answer. I don't know. I do not know, but I'm sure you are right. Amazing! Mani made the little Cleone too? Your company is pretty amazing, Yuma. Hmm? Well, if that's true, the reason the world ended up like this is because of... Be quiet. Be quiet, Leo. Hey! What am I, a lion? You said it wrong on purpose! Look. I said quiet. Don't you hear that vo- What? Voice. Guys, no. Faint sound of waves? Along with it. <laughs> oh no. song cold sweat erupts from my body as fear rears its ugly face no oh no huh? there's something over there <gasps> hi buddy how you doing there he stands, just like the time we saw him in Mashiro Metro Plaza. Chai to GTFO! Yeah! Same creature. Oh man! Kurosuke. It roars as if in response. This is a bloodlust so great. It's as if it means to kill us with the roar itself. We have to piss ourselves, get Sachi out of here. I thought we lived in the underground plaza. You know, maybe you followed us here. No. Rosuke. Uh oh. Uh, no way. He knows her name? So it really is after Sachika. Screw this! Sachka! Burn the ship completely! First of you two, we can't let him kill us here. Yuma, lead us out of here! I visualize the escape route in my head as another thought appears in my mind. I'm able to make use of them. Oh no, Yuma, no! Yup! Nope! Nope! Goodbye. Goodbye. Stop. Let me out of here. Cool. Me. <laughs> oh shit. Let me out of here. Let me out of here. Looks like we got away. But for how long? Hey, look, Haruto, you grew. <laughs> you might still be nearby. We need to proceed carefully. My, my. How shameful. I could hardly do anything but act as a wall for everyone else. Yeah, now to be on edge for the rest of the dungeon. Ain't your fault. Kuroski isn't normally strong compared to the other creatures. You know. He's strong because of his intellect. Other creatures are physically strong and have the power of Cleone. But they're pretty dumb. So this one's got brains and brawn, huh? Kind of like an upgraded Dr. Mamaru. <laughs> may not look it, but I did graduate from med school. Hmm. May catch up to us if we stayed still for too long. Yuma, do you know of a route where we can lose him? I will try. Are you alright? You alright? You don't look so good. Yes. Yes, I just need to catch my breath from all the running. 
Because I am plump and beautiful, you know. <laughs> For fuck's sake, you, but this isn't the time. Okay, then. Take a slow, deep breath. I must stay calm if I am to accomplish my mission. I put a lid on the emotion swelling inside me and bite my lips. Now do it. You're the daughter of Mashiro. I ain't standing still. I ain't Next destination standing is... still. Also, if it can follow us between dungeons, then it's certainly capable of intelligent thought. Yeah! That's my thought, too! It's coming after us specifically. Oh, hello, you. Ow! I'll hold that. That was a this dick move. I'll hold that. Cool! Give me a minute. We're going back to Garage <laughs> Island! Ah, uh, Sajika died. Hmm. Cool. That's, uh... Exactly what I did not want to have happen. I hope that thing can't come onto this island. I swear to Christ. This is my one sanctuary in this game. The only thing I want to see here is Monokuma, so I can kick his ass. I expect him to be bursting through a door. This is gonna be like all of Resident Evil, isn't it? It'll be fine as long as there won't be any math zombies. <laughs> math zombies, great, my mortal enemy. Dooga dooga doo. Dooga dooga doo. She died by something. That's not Kurosuke. Well, you got a new Shigabane. Death by Mimic Creature. Death by Putrid Bite. Sounds good to me. So Sachika can make use of those skills. The best thing about Sachika dying is that she doesn't uh, have to age. So she's totally fine. No matter what. She'll always be able to carry things. She'll always be able to be useful. Uh, I mean, why don't we actually sleep for a day? Might not be a bad idea. Oh, we did pick up another egg. Make some more fried eggs. Potatoes, rock salt. I mean, can we use potatoes for anything else? Vichy swab, but we need goat milk. Yeah, might as well make these butter potatoes. It's ready. Get that fried egg. How's this? Some herb tea. Go see stars. I mean Sachika. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, there was an evil shit fucked me up when I was a kid. Okay. All of this is fine, I suppose. Rice with raw egg. We can actually attach that stuff there. Drop off this partition. What else can we move or exchange or do something with? Leather belt, maybe gloves, monkey blood, sturdy boar scale. Man, I don't know. You know what we should do? What do we have for skills? You have two SP? Three, five, five! Five, that's what I want to see. So what can we do with five? What's your level five ability? You don't have one. That's strange. Guess we'll get you level two there. Ooh. Infighting. Farming muscles. Outrange. Hmm. Use some more item crafting, I suppose. 
You get your three. Paralysis knowledge. I mean, all that's pretty good. You know what? He can make use of those drugs. I think that's what we should, like, have him be able to do. Right, now you've got your five skill points. What can we have you do with those? Let's just get you up in middle age so we can get these things. Using them, I don't know if we will quite yet. Sure, upgrade equipment. Ah! Uh, a oh, relaxation. Uh, allies will heal more life. Oh shit, I could have gotten that. Damn it, I didn't see. Hmm. You have seven. Gourmand. Increases stamina recovery from food and decreases bladder filling rate. Done. Food lover. Decreases stress when eating food. Interesting. Apparently you know how to hunt. Hunting's an option for you. Part of survival. crafting. <laughs> item crafting level 1. We'll wait for you to get 5. Sachik, you can learn another level 5 skill or 5 skill point skill. She's learned from Haruto. She's learned from Zen. 